All right, so here is a look at the EF EOS M lens adapter. So I picked this up because I had to get an additional lens for my Canon EOS, and I have an, a Canon EFS uh, 24 mil lens, and so I needed this guy to connect them. And so here's how it comes, actually two different kind of covers that come around this guy. Uh, it has this little base part right here with a little screw on um, piece in the bottom. Um, this will be the bottom of the camera, so you kind of put this into your camera just like this, and then you are pretty much good to go. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do is I'm gonna show you guys how this is gonna go ahead and work. So I have this piece of the adapter on the left and then my 24 mil lens on the right. And so what I'm gonna go ahead and do is I'm going to connect these two guys. I'm trying to look at this through the camera. So excuse if I take a second or two to do this because I can't really see perfectly. Okay, so snaps in and then boom, tighten it up, click it in. Once it clicks, you are good to go. This will then go into my Canon EOS camera. Uh, same general idea. I'll show you guys. Give me a second to put this on in and uh, I will show you guys how it looks. All right, so we're all in and that's how it looks. Uh, essentially, the lens is like super small and this piece is just the adapter to the EOS. And then now I'm able to use this guy as I please. And here is a quick shot of me testing it out. All right, so here is me using the camera. This is from the camera lens point of view. Uh, no lighting, none of that stuff, just kind of straight up, just me using the autofocus feature. Seems to be working pretty well. I can adjust different heights and stuff, and I might adjust the angle as I fix my setup perfectly. Uh, but this is how it works. You can kind of see the background. See how I have a good vibes pillow? See how that's kind of blurred out behind me, but my face is seemingly pretty crisp and clear. That's what I was having some problems with, so I kind of got this new lens to kind of fix that. And it seems to be working great with the adapter and all. And so hopefully, this video helps you out and uh, you enjoy.